dog attack in Saline County sent one man to the hospital, and now deputies have taken those dogs from the owner. Our Haley Brooks was in the county today and has more on what happened. I'm on Terrace Drive in Saline County, and just up the road is where a woman says she saw a man being attacked by about seven dogs. And according to the sheriff's office, this isn't the first time something like this has happened. The Saline County Sheriff's Office says a man was riding his bike down this road when he was knocked off the bike and dragged across the road, then mauled. Lieutenant Ron Parsons with SCSO says two large dogs caused most of the injuries, so they were taken by deputies while five smaller dogs were left. Lieutenant Parsons says the sheriff's office has at least three police reports of dog attacks from the animals belonging to this same owner. He told me these dogs are extremely dangerous and could end up killing someone. They uh, had to put a tourniquet on the gentleman's leg. He had multiple uh, lacerations and puncture wings and an excessive amount of bleeding in his his right leg. I believe it was his right leg. The, the deputy felt that maybe one of the arteries was punctured by the dog bite. The owners were given citations for vicious dogs, and Pearson says the dogs will not be released back to those owners. According to the Saline County Sheriff's Office, Tilly, the man who was attacked by the dogs, is still at UAMS Hospital being treated for his injuries. Reporting in Saline County, I'm Haley Brooks. Back to you. And we've been told that the dogs will not be released back to the owners.